Hi everybody, Ace of Hearts Fox here, and welcome to another Fursuit Friday video. A lot of creative people tell me they put their heart and soul into an idea, and sometimes it just doesn't work out. And this can be really discouraging, but it's okay to fail as long as you use that as an opportunity to grow. So today I'm going to share with you guys my rejected or failed video ideas. These are absolutely 100% real video projects that I worked on that for one reason or another never saw the end of production. But one thing they all have in common is they have something to learn. So let's get started. Failed video number one, Ace the Science Fox. This video project was essentially a furry parody of Bill Nye the Science Guy. The idea was super simple, there would be a human scientist character and I'd be destroying his experiment. He wants to educate people, I want to see what this blue stuff tastes like. But because the only film spaces readily available to me are friends' houses, hotels, and convention spaces, I didn't exactly have a good setup for a lab scene. We wrote out a whole bunch of jokes, but we just never found the right place to film the skin. On top of that, all the props and costumes and special effects are way out of budget for a small furry YouTube channel. We really, really wanted this skit to work, but it just didn't. We even ended up filming it in a public park, and it just did not look good. I know the footage exists somewhere, and I want to try to find it, because it would be really fun to just go back and review it. So the lesson I learned here is to try ideas that are within your means. Because I could come up with the coolest, most hilarious, fun idea on the planet, but if it's outside of my budget or my skill level, it's not gonna work. Both of those problems that I experienced on this project. I tried to use Adobe After Effects, it didn't work out. I tried to make costumes, and that didn't work out. Someday, Science Fox. Failure number two, Five Nights at Furries 3. On my previous YouTube channel, we wrote a few sketch comedy videos that were basically just furry parodies of the popular Five Nights at Freddy's franchise. The first two videos were relatively popular, so it only made sense to make a third one, right? Well, we very quickly found out that it was incredibly difficult to write new material. Like, there was pretty much nothing that we could come up with that we hadn't already done in the previous two videos. So we just never ended up finishing a script for it. The main thing I took from that is that just because something is popular doesn't mean it's always going to work. Failure number three, The Poffice. This video idea was a furry parody of the popular TV series The Office. This was a video project on my previous YouTube channel and we tried to make it work. We actually wanted to turn it into a mini-series. Basically, we have a bunch of fursuiters working in an office together, and I'm the manager, and I annoy people. And somehow that benefits the company, I don't know. We came up with some pretty funny bits, some good jokes here and there, but at the end of the day, the writing kind of just fell apart. There are way too many characters, and we just couldn't find enough actors for them. Not to mention, the idea got pretty exhausting after just one episode. The main lesson I took from this failure is to keep your work as simple as possible. Like, think about parodying a show like The Office. There are so many characters and so many personalities on there, and then after you find all the actors, you'd probably have to coordinate schedules, you'd have to figure out filming dates, you'd have to get costumes for everybody. It's just a lot, man. So with your video projects, especially if they're YouTube videos, try to keep them as simple as possible. Failure number four, the Midwest Fur Flight pre-boarding video. Last year when I went to Midwest Fur Fest, there was a special flight being booked from San Francisco to Chicago. The idea was that they were going to rent out a whole block of an airplane, and it's just for furries. If you want to check out footage from that flight, I actually have it in my Midwest Fur Fest video. Link in the description. Like, I was 100% on board for this project. I even bought a pilot costume for it. That's right, I own a pilot costume that I have never opened because I did not manage my time properly. Like, I would love to try all the video ideas and do all the projects. But there's just simply not time to do everything, especially if I want to do it well. That's right, you guys thought you were getting a cute fursuit video this week, but instead it's a lesson on time management. So what's the lesson here? Learn to manage your projects. And now, our fifth and final failure today. Drunk video game characters set to bad acapella music. Yes, it's exactly what it sounds like, and yes, whatever reason you're thinking of as to why this did not work, you're probably right. Literally the whole premise of this idea was we would dress up as video game characters, walk around, and act drunk while they try to do video game stuff. Like, there were a few ideas that made us laugh, but nothing that could carry a few minutes for a video. Like, we had an idea one time where Link would get drunk, go to the hardware store, buy a bunch of vases, and throw them at people. So our mental image of Link slurring his speech and falling over while he tries to throw pots at people was actually pretty funny. But the first tapings ended up a little more cringy than funny, if I'm being perfectly honest. However, this humor did work in small doses, so who knows, maybe if Vine ever becomes a thing again, I'll put him up on there. But the important thing I took from that is something might work on paper or in theory, but in execution, not so much. And again, these failures are all okay. 
I'm pretty sure we thought it was just funnier than it actually was. So thanks for watching today's First Heat Friday video, everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. Which of these failed video ideas would you want to see become a completed project? Let me know in the comments below. Also, if you want to share any of your incomplete projects, I'd love to hear from you. Maybe include a lesson you learned from it. Either way, I do read every single comment and I try to reply to as many as possible. Also, if you really enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit like and subscribe down below for new videos every week. And if you want to directly support the content on this channel, my merch store and Patreon links are in the description box below. And speaking of patrons, I want to thank these lovely Patreon supporters for producing today's video. And I want to thank these people for sponsoring today's video. Well, that's all I got for you guys today. Thanks again for watching, everybody. My name's Ace of Hearts Fox, and I will see you all in the next video. Pssh.